The block was uh, huge for the Fighting Illini. Yeah, I, uh, I think we started off pretty strong and in the third set after the halftime there, I think we, we were playing really lax. And it really starts with our block and our defense, our whole system does. So we just needed to work harder on the block and start closing blocks. And they're a good team and they're a really good attacking team. They have good offense and a lefty on the outside, so that's kind of hard to figure out. So it took us a while to get that under control. You think of that third set just because, you know, really Illinois controlled the first two sets pretty handily. Did that play into it? Maybe, maybe you got a little too comfortable out there? Yeah, I mean, I definitely think so. That's... That's a complete mental lapse, and we can't we can't play like that if if we want to go where we want to go. And that's something that I think we need to address afterwards and make sure that we're improving on for the next match. All right, offensively you were involved uh, early and uh, not so much in the middle, but then the passing picked up again, and, and you came on late. Talk about uh, Annie's set selection tonight. Yeah, I thought Annie did a really good job of uh, getting the hitters in good position. She was reading the block and knowing where their middles were going, whether or not they were fronting me and leaving Ward and Barchi on the outside with a hole in the block or a single block. So I thought she did a good, a good job of getting us in good situations where we could try and score. You didn't expect Michigan to go down without a fight, though, did you? They they always uh, Michigan make it is tough a for tough, us. tough team, and they always put up a fight. All right, Aaron, congratulations to you and the team on a great night. Thank you very much.